Hey, what's up guys? For the last time this year, or possibly the first time next year, 2020, this is Ned Talks. Um, the only reason I made this video is because I want to talk about a certain topic. A simple topic that is very much related to the occasion today, or tonight, or tomorrow. <laughs> um, right now, it's actually New Year's Eve. To be exact, it's 8.35 p.m. December 31st. We're moments away from celebrating another year, another decade, 2020. Yep. Um, first of all, I know that my videos have had limited views, but I do have one rule here, and that's I'm not going to share this video on my own. I'm not going to force people to watch it. It's simply just me spreading out, you know, just... Giving out away, giving out information that I feel is relevant, and this is my, um, this is my canvas. Yeah, what I'm, what I'm, what I'm saying is that these words is a form of art for me, and putting it on a video, it's my canvas, it's my masterpiece. So I'm not gonna force people to watch it. I'm not gonna force people to listen or like, comment, share, subscribe, whatever. It's just me giving out my opinions on certain things. Okay, back to, so now let's go to the topic. The topic is simply about New Year's resolutions. Of course, it's not new. It's not new that we have these sorts of things, New Year's resolutions. These are the things that we want to change. So, uh, specific things that we want to change in the coming year. Like, I'm not gonna do this, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna do more of this, I'm gonna do more of that. I don't want to keep this video long, so I'm just gonna go ahead and, and tell you what I think about it. Of course, everybody has regrets. We go through a lot of stuff every year. Good, bad. We want, there's always room for improvement. There's always room for improvement. We always want to change things up. We always want to change things that we have done or we want to further improve those things. Those are the types of things that are part of our New Year's resolutions. Sometimes it doesn't necessarily have to be something that you want to change or you want to remove in your life. Sometimes it's just something that you want to maintain. Like my New Year, like for example, a person's New Year's resolution is to stay, stay as kind and as giving as last year. As long as you, you have a goal, you have a promise to yourself, that's a New Year's resolution. That's something that you want to do. But we all know that most people, I don't have any data, I don't have anything to prove this point, but I know that most people have New Year's resolutions and they can't really uh, keep, keep up to it. Like I've had, I don't necessarily plan these things, but I've always, um, Planned myself to like stay healthy, you know, eat less of something, drink less of something, but you know, it, it just doesn't happen. So like, I, I I stopped caring, I stopped planning these things. But I always set a goal for me in the coming years, but I don't necessarily call them my New Year's resolutions. But okay, what I'm trying to say here is that it's okay to have some regrets. It's okay to want to change some things. But it's also okay if you can't change it immediately. Some things take, take time. So I suggest that if you want to set um, a New Year's resolution or New Year's resolutions, try to, try to make them doable or things that you can achieve. It depends on the person, you know. It, it's not always healthy to drastically change yourself. It takes time to change certain ad attitudes, certain uh, tendencies. It takes time. It, it's not something that, snap, it, it all changes. So that's, for me, that's the, the common problem with most people is that they plan so, you know, they, they try to reach certain goals that are way too high to be accomplished within a year. You got to take things one step at a time and... Um, You've got to move 
you, you've got to really be willing to do those changes. You can't just set a goal that is hard to achieve and then expect it to be achieved easily. No, you gotta, you gotta know what, how, how capable you are of doing these things and you've got to know if these things are really doable. You know, because sometimes we set goals too high that we can't achieve it. We can't achieve them in the time that we set for ourselves. It takes some New Year's resolutions take like three years, four years to complete. See? So you gotta really take it slow. Take it little by little. Every little change is is good, you know. Every type of improvement is good. So if you really want to improve something something in yourself, be willing to do so and take things slowly, take everything one step at a time. And lastly, I just want to wish everyone a happy new year. I hope we all achieve our goals and I hope we all have uh, great health, you know, great companionship. I hope we all get money <laughs> and um, most of all, you know, I, I hope we get the love that we all deserve. Peace out. Happy New Year, baby.